This isn't really a robbery. I mean, he's been ripping me off on overtime for years. If anything, I'm just getting my back pay. He's at a party with regional managers, so he's not even home. I just have to grab that stupid portable safe he goes on about and bail. There has to be something valuable in there. I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't believe it either. Hello everyone, Riku Namiko here, and this is... Oh hell, I don't even remember what this is. I think it's called Red Ring. Uh, it's a game I found on itch.io. I'll leave a link in the description down below. But the game just started, and it looks like I am here to rob my manager of some kind of safe in his house. So... This is like the weirdest looking street. Where are all the houses? Your store manager lives all the way out here in the middle of nowhere? What's going on? Is that my heartbeat? Okay, so I guess I shouldn't run all that often. Okay, so it's a lean mechanic. No flashlight equipped, okay. I can jump. I'm making a lot of noise. Oh! Okay. I should have brought a light. Yeah, you should have brought a light. What the hell were you thinking? That is the weirdest sound I should she's making. Flashlight. Okay. Hey, let there be light. Alright, and let me have that VHS, that's cool. Why is this open? Can I duck? Oh, there is a duck button. Doesn't look like there's anything inside this little cabinet. Man, for this being my manager's apartment, it's... or house, I guess? It's definitely kind of barren. Where's all this stuff? I should read those directions. Okay. Add it to inventory. What's my inventory? Oh, okay, it's tab. Okay. Can I actually select, like, anything else here? It doesn't look like it. Oh, okay. Scroll the mouse wheel. Duh. Alright, step one, turn on the TV, left click. Step two, turn on VHS. Uh, right click on the VHS player. Uh, switch and select your VHS from inventory, left click on to insert in the player. When you see you're ready, you have three options. And it doesn't look that difficult.
Okay, that's kind of loud. I will leave that off for the time being. Yeah, second like VHS. Okay. Let's explore the house a little bit more. Why is this house so bare? It doesn't even look lived in. That's literally what I just said. Okay. Dude, there's nothing in here. It's like a loft. With barely any furniture. I mean, heck, he's not even at this place, so... You could literally just turn on the lights and go through all his stuff. Doesn't look like he has any neighbors, either. That's odd. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm in the wrong house. Excuse me? I think I'm just gonna... Yeah, you're right. I do need to leave. Uh, sorry about that. And this I'm out of here. Twenty twenty four. What the? What just happened? And number one in our list of top ten worst legal defenses comes the Red Ring Murderer. For those of you too young to remember the Red Ring Murderer, from July of 1993 to January of 1994, this person was on an unaliving spree, and the M.O. was that they would, let's just say, take apart their victims and then leave the remnants in a bathtub. And they got their name from the Red Ring that would be left behind after all the evidence was collected. And then one night, when an officer was checking on an unattended vehicle, 24-year-old Kelly Reardon came running out of an unattended house, which she claimed the Red Ring murderer was in. However, upon examining the house, no one was inside. So, of course, she said the murderer must have slipped away while she was talking to the officer. So, of course, as one would, the officer asked why she was in the house. After a series of non-answers, she finally came out and said that she was there to rob her boss. And when the officer asked how she expected to find her boss's things in a vacant home, she claimed that she took a wrong turn and accidentally went to the wrong house. Very convenient. So needless to say, she was asked to take a ride downtown for some questioning. And this isn't even the craziest part. Fast forward to her jury trial, and she actually claimed that the real Red Ring murderer was District Attorney Vincent Johnson, a.k.a. the prosecutor on her case. Now, legal experts agree this was likely a move on Reardon's part to get Johnson and his 98% conviction rate recused from the trial. And uh, needless to say, that did not work. And even more bafflingly, she maintained this story even four years later, on the day she was executed by the state, or as I like to call it, the finding out phase. The moral of this story, don't kill anyone, kids. Y'all have a good one. What the hell? Okay, okay, okay. I gotta see what's on those tapes now. One VHS. Why is this house so bare? It doesn't even look lived in. I could have told you that. Uh, 
Oh shoot, where was that other one? I should read those directions. Alright, and then there was one more upstairs. Alright, so the killer is in that room. Okay. Tape one of three. Oh shoot, what did the instructions say? Right click on the VHS player, okay. It says ready, let's go. We've cleaned all of the shower walls and the shower door and the runners, and now it's time to clean the tub itself. You notice we haven't rinsed yet. This is just a big bubbly mess, all the walls and everything, but we're only gonna rinse one time, and that's after we finish the tub. It saves a lot of time. So let's grab for our comet, and we're going to apply a little comet to the tub. You know how to do that. We're real sparing with it. We don't want to want to use much. It's hard to rinse away, and especially if you get it outside the rim of the tub itself. Keep it in the bowl of the tub. Okay. Be kind, rewind. VHS ejected. Okay. I can do the Hamilton rap. How does a bastard orphan son of a whore and a Scotsman dropped in the middle of a forgotten spot in the Caribbean and Providence impoverished its wallet. Grow up to be a hero and a scholar. The ten dollar found in father without a father got a lot farther by working a lot harder by being a self-starter by working a lot harder by 14. They placed him in charge of a trading charter. Then every day slaves were being chartered and parted away across the waves he struggled and kept his guard up. Inside he was hoping for something to be a part of the brother was ready to beg, steal, borrow a barter. Then a hurricane came and devastation reigned. The man saw his future dri dripping down the drain. Put a pencil to his temple, connected it to his brain. Then he wrote his first refrain, a testament to his pain. But the word got around, they said, this kid is insane, man. Took a book collection just to get him to the mainland. Get your education, don't forget from once you came. And the world's gonna know your name. What's your name, man? Hey, thanks, Sonic Cosplayer, for that uh, riveting music selection. I enjoyed that thoroughly. All right, take three. Faith, family, country. These are the three pillars this great city stands on. And to keep these pillars strong, we must remain tough on crime. 
And if you reelect me as your district attorney, these pillars will remain stronger than ever. Vote for me, Vincent Johnson, as your district attorney. Wow. I'm guessing that there was no actual safe in this place. Okay, well, I will go back upstairs and I will actually confront the killer this time. And I guess that's it. Let's see what happens when we die. Oh, you're not going to let me go in there. And he destroyed that tub, too. You need to leave. Okay, you know what? How about I stay? Huh? You gonna make me leave? Huh? Are you? Are you? You aren't even turning around. You jerk. I'll even turn off my flashlight, because I ain't scared of you. Even though I already know what my future's going to hold. Which sucks, in the grand scheme of things. There's a cop by my car, oh thank god. There's not much of a road out here either. Okay, I think that's probably all that this game had to offer. Uh, the store page did say that there was only one ending, so... Not bad! Not bad! Anywho, uh, yeah, like I said, I'll leave a uh, link down in the description below if you want to check this game out for yourself. But this was Red Ring. And not bad, not bad for what it was. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one, real soon.